you know the world is yours baby life is yours man nobody keeps us from being anything nobody keeps us from doing anything that we want to do except our own mind except our own self-image except our own self-esteem your self-image is responsible for your success baby because if you can't see yourself doing having being and going places you can't do those things i know that to be true first of all because i have done it i have been through it i also know it to be true because i have been coaching man and i've seen the struggle of being able to picture themselves walking certain path accessing certain level of opportunity and freedom doing certain things that require high levels of self esteem the current self image cannot sustain your next level of freedom from porn so we're going to have to change that you are on the right path you are on the right journey the journey of self discovery the journey of self love the journey of self empowerment stay on this journey successful recovery from any addiction requires a total revamp of your life it requires a total reconfiguration of your mind and your entire life so let's look at reason number 1 why that's necessary one self image your current self image cannot help you in recovering from porn because your current self image is one of failure it's one of weakness it's one of inability it's one of neediness you understand it's one of learned helplessness it's one of pain you don't see yourself the way that a lot of people see yourself in fact your inner critic is bigger and louder than the people around you the people around you see you in a more favorable light than you see yourself they trust you more than you trust yourself you don't have a good self image to help you recover and sometimes that is in the way even to begin your recovery journey because you cannot picture yourself because your everything that you have right now the, the entire life that you have right now has been uh, created by porn or has been serving porn it serves your addiction it holds your addiction in place so therefore you can't even see a better life you can't even see if that life is possible if a porn free life is possible You know as I often say today I can hardly believe that this is my life a porn free life an addiction free life a masturbation free life a beautiful life of power of self knowledge of freedom of dynamism of magnetism manifestation so self esteem and self image are one of the reasons that you have to create a new life for you you're going to have to adapt new ways of seeing yourself you're going to have to adapt new self image what is self image self image is the way the self sees the self on the inside it's the way you see yourself subconsciously it's the way that you picture yourself unconsciously It's been said that you cannot earn more than your self-esteem and your self-image allows for. You can't drive a beautiful car if your self-image has not taken that in, into consideration. If you cannot picture yourself in that car, if you cannot picture yourself with this amount of money, you cannot earn it. If you cannot picture yourself being free, living every single day without this handicap and living this life of higher purpose, of freedom of joy if you can't picture that then you can't recover from porn so you're going to have to go through a whole process of reconfiguring your brain 
so that you have a new self-image, so that you have a new way of looking at yourself. Instead of a man who begins a successful journey and then falls, now you can see yourself as a man who begins a successful journey, falls, gets up, falls, gets up, and continues the journey to success and to completion. Your self-image is responsible for your success, baby. Because if you can't see yourself doing, having, being, and going places, you can't do those things. I know that to be true, first of all, because I have done it. I have been through it. I also know it to be true because I have been coaching men. And I've seen the struggle of being able to picture themselves walking certain path, accessing certain level of opportunity and freedom, doing certain things that require high levels of self-esteem. So your self-image, your current self-image cannot sustain your next level of freedom from porn. So we're going to have to change that. Reason number two is you are your current environment. Your current environment has a hypnotic effect on you. And by hypnotic effect, I mean as soon as you enter that environment, your cognitive abilities decrease so that your environment takes over, so that your environment enslaves you because you are a slave of your environment. You serve your environment. As soon as you come to the doors, you either are going to pick up the remote and turn on the TV and go to the fridge and grab you uh, whatever to eat, to munch on, or you're going to go to your office and sit down and do some work. Because if whichever one your environment is conditioned for you or, or is set up for you to do, that's what you're going to do. And by environment here, I'm talking about a lot, not just physical environment. I'm also referring to mental environment, your mental space, where you spend most of your time. Yes. I'm also talking about your social environment, where you go often and the people you hang out with often. Those are environments. And... I'm also talking about geographical environment. The city you live in, the state you live in, the area of the city you live in, all of, all of those things have, will have an impact on how well you recover and if you ever recover successfully altogether. Because if you keep hanging out with the same people and every once in a while they send you a nude from some girl they met, they saw on Instagram, and they send you a porn video. You know, those videos that don't quite qualify to be a porn video, but they are porn because the women are naked and whatever they're doing with men, that's basically just porn. Like that WAP video is basically porn, uh, but legal porn or porn in mainstream, you could call it. If you have friends who can do that, then that will deter you. That will take you off your path at any given moment without even knowing because those friends are feeding you um, stimuli contrary to your current work. You understand? And of course, as, as, as far as your physical environment goes, as soon as you go into your environment, you are enslaved by it. Have you ever watched porn without remembering how you actually started? How you actually, when you actually reached for the laptop, you, you, you don't quite remember? That's what happens with your, your environment. Because the laptop or the computer was is always in the same place. So your bed is in the same place. So you went and lay down, grabbed for the computer, reached for the computer, did your thing, and didn't even realize that you were doing it but imagine being in a different environment 
and where your bed is on the left side and your computer is on the right side. You're going to have to go get up and go sit down or you, you're going to have to do some things that your brain is not accustomed to do. And that would change something that would help you to maintain your recovery journey. Number three, you need to create a new life simply because the opportunity is there for you. Mm -hmm. Simply because you can. You know, you can. You can enlarge your territory. You can reinvent yourself. The opportunity is there. There is an opportunity cost associated with not doing so. You can do it. Life is yours. These people who are being successful are no better than you. They have the same things that you have. You know, they have the same abilities that you've been given. So for the simple fact that it's there to do, why not take a chance? Why not jump? Why not reinvent yourself? It's there for you. Take the opportunity. Push back on your limits. Show yourself that you can do something that you've never thought possible for your own self. Do something that you can be proud of personally. You know, the world is yours, baby. Life is yours, man. Nobody keeps us from being anything. Nobody keeps us from doing anything that we want to do except our own mind, except our own self-image, except our own self-esteem. So you're going to have to reinvent yourself if you are to recover from porn. And live that beautiful life, baby. That that the good life that's out there. If you need help, check out my Patreon. My hope is that w- one of you will be free, or as free as I am one day. One of you will taste the freedom that I am enjoying right now in my life. Remember, you are king, and stay in your kingdom. Until next time. Namaste.